How long have you been offering this bachelor's? It's a new program. The first class of students have just completed their second year. It's a program which is going fast. It's certainly the school's intention that this will become another of our flagship programs. I don't know whether you know, we have another highly ranked program, which is the Master in Management, which is the sort of classic program of the school, which is a postgraduate degree. It's ranked fourth worldwide by the Financial Times amongst Master in management programs. So it's extremely prestigious. It attracts two types of students, either graduates of other institutions who come after completing their undergraduate degree, apply for admission or are admitted for the two-year master's. And then a lot of the students reflecting the, the historical origins of the school as a French grand they call a lot of the students in the master in management have done what's known as uh, class preparatoire, which are two years very intensive program of study in order to prepare for the national competitive exams to enter the Grande École. So there's a mix of students. The bachelor's program, the students come really with a different profile. A lot of them are French. We attract students from all over Europe, French, Germany and Italy, the three most represented countries. But as I say, from really all over Europe and from way way beyond, thankfully. And I think it's equally demanding, equally selective, but it's rather a different profile of students. The the class preparatoire in the French system is a very rigid um, academic training, which is, I think, really for students who want that type of approach. In the bachelors, we only admit very high academically achieving students, but the profile, I think, tends to be they they're younger, obviously, they're two years younger, and they tend to be rather more diverse and more dynamic, personally, I would say. And I think it's a program which is designed and most suited to students who have those two characteristics. They're diverse, they're dynamic, and also who want to professionalize very young. So, for example, when I went to university, I was very happy to be a student for three years and to live a sort of distinctively student and lifestyle. And a lot of the students on the bachelor's programme, they're actually very keen to start as soon as possible to develop really their, their vocation for the world of work and professional life. And so, for example, all students have to complete two internships at the end of their second year and at the end of their third year. But a large proportion, the majority of our students of these first two classes have actually chosen to do internships after their first year. And they get really quite impressive internships. You know, we have students now, the ones who've completed their second year, doing internships with Deutsche Bank, with the German Foreign Ministry, with General Electric, with Amazon, with really major companies. And in general, in terms of the orientation of their studies and what they're looking for, it's their students who want and are hungry for the world of work. Are you listening? Damn.